Good morning, guys. Uh, it is Monday, the 16th of September, the start of Freshers' Week in Exeter. Uh, you join me in uh, sunny, uh, maybe not sunny anymore, Jury, Exeter. Um, a lot of people have been asking me for sort of a ride along kind of how much do you make in a week kind of video. Uh, so I've got our new dash cam all installed. I'm gonna give it a bit of a go. I'm gonna sprinkle, I'm gonna do like how much can I make on Freshers' Week. Um, sprinkle a little bit of dash cam footage in there here and there if I can I'm gonna try my best don't know how to work it that well just yet though so you have to be patient with me um, so it is around about half nine quarter to ten at the moment um, we're about to go online I'm out at Tesco big Tesco at the moment I need to get some nappies for the twins so I have done one job on the way out here so we've got a little bit of a head start only four pound and eight P uh, funny enough little Tesco to big Tesco um, well, halfway there at least. So four pound eight p is better than uh, driving somewhere for nothing. Something I always say to people: if you need to go somewhere um, and you think you might get a job on the way, always turn your apps on, even if you are on a day off, because you can make money that way quite easily. I went in; it was ready, grabbed it straight away. Um, so we will be doing Uber Eats, Just Eat, Deliveroo, Stuart. Stuart is Tesco Wush, um, Co-op co Home Delivery. Um, also, I've got a contractor that I work with. Um, I've just texted him this morning. He might have some parcels for me. He pays me a pound a drop. Um, it's always nice to easy money. It's basically where I live. Um, so it's very easy. I know the area very well. We can normally do sort of 30, 35 an hour. Um, there's also a Morrison's at the bottom of the road. So sometimes if I'm running ahead of my ETAs, I'll pick up from Morrison's, drop it off just up the road and then come back. It's basically easy money. If it happens, you'll see later on in the video. Um, and I'll go through at the end of the video, at the end of the week, how much I've made all week. Uh, so I might not make as much as some of the people out there just because I've got quite a lot of responsibilities. Uh, you join me just after having done the school runs. Um, I will have to do the school run again this afternoon. And it's basically the same every day. And then I probably might well take Thursday off, Saturday off as well. Um, and then go hard on Sunday. Uh, but yeah, let's see how much I can make this week on Fresh Sweet because the last couple of years have been really good. But the way things have gone, I'm not 100% sure how it's going to go. So, I a um, bit of dash cam footage here. Um, first job uh, since I turned all the apps on came through within about five minutes. Um, so, yes, I'm now over on my way over to Greg's, which is about ooh, five, ten minutes away. Uh, cheeky order, £7.36, only three and a half miles total distance. Uh, Greg's generally not a bad pickup, um, and it'll be quite an easy drop off as well. So, not a bad start to the day, all in all. easy quick pick up uh, so I'm on my way to the customer now I'm gonna by the way all these bits uh, there it speeds up that's not me speeding up in the car that is uh, I don't want to make this video too long so I'm just speeding the time up a little bit uh, just still give you a little bit of the experience um, without it taking forever uh, but yeah on the way to the customer now I'm probably gonna do this one order with you um, and then sort of crack on my day a little bit 
and then um, I'll maybe either catch up with you at the sorting centre if I get some parcels or perhaps uh, when I have my break later on when I'm picking up my daughter. Um, either way, I shall see you in a little while and I'm going to crack on and see how much money I can do up until about half past two, quarter three when I need to take a break. Guys, you join me now at about uh, 20 to 1, and as you can see, I picked up a um, car full of parcels. Uh, so 50 parcels, so it'd be 50 quid. Um, took me around about 30 to 40 minutes to pick them up. Uh, I'm hoping I'll be able to do half of them before I go into the school run, if maybe even a little bit more. Uh, but I've got a long way to go. If you look out that window there, um, Exeter is way way in the distance so yeah I've got to drive back to Exeter now um, so hopefully I'll get a job on the way that will um, pay me a little bit of money to get back to this round. Hey guys you now catch me um, on the afternoon school run so far the day's been not too bad I did manage to pick up one uber job on the way back through to the parcel run seven pound and seven p a bit of a Brucey bonus there. So that means all in all, uh, over that first five hour period that I've done, I did five food delivery jobs, uh, £33.43p. Uh, but I also managed to do um, 34 of the parcels. I mean, so far, my total is £67 in five hours, which is 13 49 an hour. But that's not quite correct, because obviously I did spend a lot of time out at the parcel centre, picking up the parcels, going out there and coming back and all that sort of stuff. Um, so that does drag my hourly rate down, which will be compensated for later on, because I've still got parcels in the car that I need to do later. So those parcels will be done at obviously a higher rate. But I shall catch up with you a bit later on, maybe probably at the end of the day, let you know how I got on. Uh, I don't want this video to be too long, so I'm just gonna start speeding things along a little bit for you. But yeah, so far so good. Um, I haven't really noticed many of the students back yet, so um, we'll wait and see as the week goes on, um, if that happens. Now, five o'clock, I've just finished off the parcels, uh, so I did another 17 parcels, and it only took me half an hour uh, to finish the last of the round, which is obviously amazing. Um, really happy with that. Obviously that's 34 quid an hour, isn't it? So can't say better than that. Uh, so it's now five o'clock, um, hopefully, um, Freshers Week will start kicking in, in a minute, because I don't think it's that busy just yet for a Freshers Week on a Monday. Um, if it looks like it's not going to be that busy, then I might just call this a one day kind of thing, and then may, uh, maybe make it episode one, and um, do the... Do like a episode two at the end of the week where I'll tell you how the rest of the week went on. Um, just because if it's not going to be very exciting, not much point. Anyway, um, I should go back online with the food deliveries apps now and uh, I'll check in with you later, let you know how I'm getting on. So guys, it's now half past seven. I'm absolutely lagging. It's uh, quieting down over the last half an hour, although it has been quite busy tonight. Um, so yeah, it's been pretty good to be fair to you. I haven't done any deliveries to students whatsoever. Um, but that's not the end of the world. I'm happy with the deliveries I've done. It's been actually easier deliveries than going to the students' uh, accommodation, that's for sure. Uh, so let's go through what I've earned today. So I did £51 on the parcels. Um, Just Eat, £45.32. Uh, Uber Eats, Fourteen pounds and seven pence. Deliveroo, just one order and Deliveroo today, seven pounds seventeen p. Bit disappointed with Deliveroo. I thought it was going to be really busy on Deliveroo today. Um, but yeah, maybe because students come back, a lot of the students do Deliveroo as well. 
Um, maybe that's made a bit of a difference. And Stuart, um, ten pound and fifty two p. So that's two Tesco wish orders that I did. Actually, it might have been one co op, one Tesco order. I don't know. Uh, but anyway, there we go. Uh, so that brings me a total of one hundred and twenty pounds and eighty four pence. Working um, eight hours over, obviously five uh during school time and then three after school time after the school run um so it brings me out an hourly rate of 15 pounds and 10 pence per hour for the day which isn't too bad it's a little bit lower than it used to be um but that's mainly because um the parcels used to get dropped to me um not a thing anymore unfortunately so that makes a bit of a difference because that takes up maybe 45 minutes to an hour of my day um, so obviously that would push my hourly rate right up. Drove 64.8 miles. Um, not going to go into that too much at this point because it's different for everyone. I do do a monthly um, how much do I earn where I break down all my expenses and stuff like that as well. So if you're interested, please go ahead and find those videos. I am going to end this video now. I know I said I'd do the full week, uh, but I'm very aware that it's getting quite long already. It's already about 10 minutes long. Um, so what I'm going to do is say, if you made it this far, obviously you're interested, um, I'm going to make a second episode, which I will do next Monday, uh, going through how much I am throughout the whole week, and whether the freshest week it was as good as I was expecting to be, etc, etc. Um, if you've enjoyed the video, I would really, really appreciate it if you liked, comment, subscribed, all that jazz. Um, if you liked the, like, the bits where I did a bit like ride along uh, I know they're quite popular videos with other creators so I wanted to just give it a go and they've done it before so um, just let me know in the comments um, it could be something that I might do a little bit more as time goes on um, especially if I get over 4,000 watch hours on YouTube start getting a bit more money out of it because um, I did find it quite time consuming today and it kind of like that pretty dragged down my average my average hourly rate because there was a couple of times where I was faffing around um, with the dash cam trying to get footage out of it so yeah if you're interested in that please let me know in the comments down below um, hopefully you've enjoyed the video and I'll see you next Monday when I upload the second episode um, going through how, much, how the rest of the week went catch you later thanks goodbye